Everything's good to go. Yeah, game four is going to be once again Ascension Team Snipers just waiting to get this kicked off. We'd like to thank our friends over at Astro Gaming for supplying us on the main stage with some awesome headsets here. And as you see, some Master Chief Collection exclusive tags. We'll have more about those. Stay tuned. We're waiting for this match to get underway in just a moment. And then we'll jump on board with the players as you see them all awaiting the go-ahead from the station referee. Not just yet. We're waiting for the final players to get into the match. And I think we're going to see them kick it off. And Golden Boy, who do you want to start with? Uh, you know what? I want to. I want to go to Chalky. As a matter of fact, let's All right. uh, hop on board with him. TCM's Chalky are putting oh. a couple body shots down. Buck 57 is going to be one shot there as well. One to zero already. TCM looking good, but one to one now off the break. And I don't know who oh, has rockets just yet. Sees a player right there. Misses two shots on Javi though. Not good. He's going to want to stay alive. Rockets could still be out. We'll see you guys' eyes here on Xavi, who I believe is actually still behind that post. And Xavi gets booked up. Now they're up 3-1. to one. No one has the Rockets just yet, Bravo. I'm looking around to see if anyone has it on our side. But nope, not going to be the case here. Yep. As uh, it seems like that is not going to be as much of a game changer. But Xavi is uh, debating hitting the interactive element and does. He fires that up to let his team move around out of big tower. But Buck 20 does have the rocket launchers. Let's switch back over to him. And he picks up that kill right there. Nice job of bringing his team back into it. They have big tower control as well as the rocket launcher. Lethal now pushes in. Javi now trying to win this battle of small tower as well. Oh. And Buck 20 gets taken out there. A nice job by Riots, who's pushing in and shooting the body just a bit, as you see on your death screen. Yep, that's right. Eight to four here. Of course, blue team in the lead as uh, Lethal and the crew are trying their absolute best to just bring this one back. They're going to be down by six now. Yeah. But of course, Team Snipers, anything could change. They all have the same advantage. They're all at equal footing here. And uh, small tower, small tower control may not be as wanted Ooh. though. And oh my goodness, you have uh, Chalky and Riots taking out two buck twenty and Zavi. Yeah. Now it's going to be thirteen to five. Yeah. Looking at the team composition right here of TCM, we have a player at shotgun. We have a player right now uh, around the middle of the map. And Foxy at big tower holding it down. Let's switch over to Riots. He's been super impressive so far in this match. Kicking it off now, 14 to 7. They're poised to win the finals right here, Golden Boy. Yeah, that's right. I mean, if they keep going the way that they are, looking over by Banshee, finding someone. Oh. He's going to get a body shot there, and he can't follow it up with the other so one. So much help, though. Look at that. Exactly. Not hitting either headshot, but shots coming in from all directions now. 18 to 8. A nice job here from TCM. Very strong opening. Yep, that's right. That's going to be another sniper kill there. Trying to go for that quick scope. Finding Lethal in front. Lethal can't stay alive long enough. That's going to be a double kill. Going for the quick scope. Not going to happen for Riot stairs. We'll stick with him off the respawn. Let's see. Is they're going to apply some more pressure over toward Banshee? Yeah, it looks like Riot is... Oh, like, look at him. He's flying out of the base. He needs to slow it down just a bit. Take it down a notch. His team does have an, a 10 kill lead, but you can't afford to just be jumping out like that. Yeah, and the thing about snipers, too, is that you're going to see a lot of crossing, right? I mean, it, it's not going to be necessary for you to push as a team in right. this case, because you can always have someone watching over your, uh, over your shoulder with that sniper rifle. Essentially, everyone becomes the quarterback, right? everyone becomes a top chef but here's the thing there sometimes could be too many cooks in the kitchen that's true and uh we could see some miscommunication here perhaps that's what's happening to vws right now because they're not on the same page yeah it's 26 to 14 in favor of tcm as oh. riots gets punished for pe poking out a second time and we'll see he does have 10 kills though leading his team and the match man riots just on fire here looks going on is uh let's go ahead and jump over to zavi who's actually gonna have no shields trying to stay alive now and he will get that assist. That will be his teammate there for the pick. That's going to be yep. two members of TCM down at this time. VWS trying to just do what they can to stay in this matchup here, stay competitive in this game. Big oh, tower control, no. And that, but no mid control coming, being a little bit more important, yeah, Bravo. Golden Boy, I was going to mention, you can be deadly from any position on the map. In Team Sniper's Ascension, you're going to see positions that are never used in regular Team Slayer because you can oh, be man. super sneaky. Look at that, two entrails passing by his body as Zavi drops once again. TCM, a 33 to 19 lead. Let's see what Ramirez is up to with that rocket launcher. TCM is looking to just close this one out right here they do not want a game five at all because they know that vws could very well and, contend with them here and look how quickly tc look at ramirez just flying out with the rockets no hesitation they're up by 17 here in team snipers golden boy which is absurd if you look at how quickly they're oh. playing this game and but does get punished there for poking out just a little bit too much sometimes players can get a little too overzealous and that was a Pretty much a great instance of it there. Now, Ramirez off the respawn is only going to have that sniper, which obviously is one of the best things to have. But when everyone has it, everyone's on equal footing. Those rockets, though, are going to be right for the oh, picking. And, and there goes like that a, shield. That's a VWS interactive element uh, laid down. Let's, we'll see if they can pop up and maybe get across the map with this. 39 to 23. The match isn't over, but TCM only 11 kills away from five grand. 
Yep, that's right. Moving in now, trying to get that. Oh, wow, there you go. That's going to nice be the shot there. and the beat down there. Slam shot beat down. Oh. One player is going to be hanging out Needs over by Banshee this. Pad. Yes, he does oh. need to finish that. And he. Oh, oh! oh my goodness. And I don't know who that was. Let's see on that. That TCM. was Zavi. Amazing stuff there from Zavi. Punishing him on BWS. A really nice oh, play. Wow. Now 41 to 25. Ramirez on the receiving end of a whooping, but his team is still up by quite a bit. So no hesitation from him. Yeah, he won't really care too much about that one, considering that he looked yeah, at mean, the look scoreboard. I mean, look at him. Just, I mean, playing, look at playing so aggressive, just jumping out. But they can afford to do that, Golden Boy. They're up by such a large margin, 41 to 26. Just so seven minutes left in this match, but VWS cannot die nine times. If they do, the match is over, and they've got quite a bit of work ahead of them. Yeah, I mean that's an understatement there, Bravo. I mean, honestly, it seems like this is going to be next to impossible for VWS yeah. to come back from if it keeps going this and way. But the thing is, though, they're picking off kills, yep. and now, that, but here's the thing, they're exposing themselves for every one kill, though, that's just going to cause them, oh, that's going to be a body shot there, 42, it's going to be a 12-point game right now, you have all three members actually like on the right a, side. Might be a push here, a little bit of miscommunication as we see a player pushing down here, uh, they're going to, Chalky's going to turn around and try to oh. pick up that kill, but we do have two VWS players down there as well, now taking a look at the score as Ramirez spawns in, 42 to 32, it's a 10-kill game. Yep, that's right, and uh, it seems like, of course, it was Buck 20 trying to stay alive over there as well. Looking over by the oh. Banshee Pad, finding one, going for it, but now he's not going to secure that's it. Double. That's going to be the double oh, kill for him as well. Away, Golden Boy. And TCM could very well become your Gamescom 2014 Halo Showdown champions with this right here, 47 to 33. One player is going to be bottom of the big tower. Let's oh. go! No, no connection for him on that one. 48 kills, 49 yep. kills, one more remaining, and, and that's, that's going to do it. it, TCM are your Halo Gamescom Showdown champions. A nice job there from TCM. What, almost 3-0-ing the series, but instead having to go to a game four after dropping game two by one kill, proving that they are the team to beat in Europe. That's right. Congratulations to them. But of course, give it up for both team guys in the crowd. Big shout out to VWS for coming out and playing. And of course, a big thank you to TCM and everyone else who's participated in the Halo Gamescom Showdown. Yeah, we had some of the best European teams here all week long and only eight remained. VWS and TCM, the last two teams, and TCM comes out on top. We want to thank you so much for joining us. Stay tuned as we'll have a winner's ceremony in just a moment.